Google Chat is a business level messaging tool for Google Workspace that allows you to chat one on one and in groups called Spaces within your business and even with clients and contractors outside of your domain. Its integrations with Google Workspace tools like Google Sheets, Docs, and Slides, right inside Google Chat, along with a Google Tasks tab and a convenient file library tab, make it a really handy business tool. But one of the things that is often overlooked is that you can add chat apps or chatbots to your Google Chat Spaces or DM a chat app directly to conveniently accomplish a task. There are hundreds of third-party chat app integrations for you to choose from, anything from project management to customer support and more. Or you can build your own chat app in-house or hire a dev to build one for you. Chat apps can respond to messages, respond to specific slash commands, and carry out automations and execute scripts. Once called, they can generate messages, cards, and preview links. Chat apps can also create private dialogues for use to complete forms. Chat apps can feel more seamless than using standalone applications and may be a better option for you and your teams and can even enhance your team's workflow in chat. Chat apps are available in Google Chat Direct Messages by selecting the Start a Chat Plus button and clicking Find Apps. From there, select your app and install. You can also add a chat app into Google Chat Spaces along with other domain members and external users. Let's create a Google Chat Space called Monies and invite a colleague from my Google Workspace domain account and add an extra external Gmail user. Then we'll add my custom built currency converter I created using Google Apps Script. My currency converter uses slash commands to generate currency conversions based on the current conversion rate sourced from a third party API. Once I have installed the chat app, other members in my domain can use the add on. Let's switch over to the tester account and run the slash exe list slash command. All users of the space can see the results of the chat app. However, our external users will not be able to use the chat app itself. This makes it ideal for quickly supporting requests from clients with quality data. Chat apps can really boost your workspace productivity and provide unique solutions for your business. In the next tutorial, we'll look at what you can build with chat apps using Google Apps Script before diving into a hands-on tutorial after that. So I have some questions for you. Have you used chat apps before? What's your recommended app for Google Chat? After this tutorial, do you think you'll give one a try? I'd be interested to hear in the comments below. If you have enjoyed this chat app overview, let me know by liking the video. If you want to get notified when the next video in this series comes out, subscribe and hit that notification bell. Until next time.